Let's talk about relationships. Database relationships. Imagine we have a chat app where users type in their names and then send messages. But when they change their names, the old messages don't update. Not great. Let's see what's going on under the covers. So our app has just one table called messages and each record contains both the message body and the name of the person who sent the message. What we need instead is a separate table to hold users in their names, and then we update the messages table to contain a reference to each sender's user record. That way, every message from that user is referring to the same nickname field. This reference makes a relationship between the two tables, and this is what people mean when they talk about relational databases. So now, when we update a user's name, everything looks right. How great is it when relationships work out?